All right. In this lecture, I'm going to show you how can you convert your Python project to exe file. So you can convert your Python files to executable files very easily. So with this way, your Python project will act like a desktop application and you will be able to run application in other Windows machines or Mac machines without installing Python. So here to do so, we are going to use autopy to exe library. So the first thing that I'm going to do, I need to install autopy to exe library. So I'm going to open terminal and write pip install autopy to exe. So if I hit enter, it's going to download this library to our laptop over here. Now after doing so, we need to open autopy to exe library over here. So inside terminal, I'm just going to put, put clear over here and I'm going to write autopy to exe. So if I hit enter, you'll see that it's going to open an application like this. Now here, you can select your Python file as a path. Then we'll continue to select these options over here. Now, the first thing that I'm going to do, I need to find out the location of Python file that I want to convert to exe file. Now here, I have created a project like this in which we have only pre statement. So if I run our project, you'll see that it's just printing out saying that hello, Ershad. So I'm just going to convert main py file to exe file over here. So I'm going to select the location of this file that we created over here in which we have only one print statement. So I'm just going to create click browse. So it's located inside this executable folder. So I'm just going to select main py file and open it. Then the next option is we need to select one file on one directory. Now, if you have more than one file in your directory, you can select one directory. If you have only one file that I have over here, which is main py file, you can select this option over here, which is one file. Then the next option is console window. Now, if your project generates console based on the outputs you need to choose, you need to select the console base. But if you have GUI application or you don't want to show the console output to the user, in this case, you just need to select the Windows base. So here, when you run up your application, it's going to hide the console. Here, it's going to show the console. Now, in this case, it's just printing out this message to the console. So that's why I'm just going to select console based application. Then you can select the icon, additional files, advanced and settings based on your needs over here. Now, after doing so, if I hit this button, which says convert py to exe file, it will take some time to convert it. Now, after converting it, it will give us an option to open the output folder. Now, if I hit this button over here, it's going to open the, the folder in which I have the main exe file. So in this case, I'm using Mac. So that's why it's created Unix executable file over here. But if you are using Windows, it's going to create for Windows executable file over here. Now, if I click on this and run it, you will see that in this case, it's opening the file and you see that it says that hello Elshad over here. So it's executed in the terminal over here. So as you can see, by using autopy to exe library, we can easily convert our Python files to the exe file and we can run it on any device that we want. So with this, we have come to the end of this video. So hopefully everything is clear about how can you convert your Python file to exe files using autopy to exe libraries over here. So if you like the video, do not forget to subscribe our channel and hit thumbs up button below this video. So see you in the next video.